Yo, what's going on guys, it's your boy me and today I'm going to talk about the new update for the Dolphin Emulator on Xbox. In this new update, there's a new in-game pause menu, which looks absolutely beautiful. There is now a save states tab, but beware that it can be buggy with dual core enabled, so do not rely on them or you may risk losing your progress. But this is cool for those who would love to use save states instead. Now for the options tab, you have all the available options that you normally would see through the regular menu, and they also added the net play tab. Now there's a new and improved front end, including a new tab system to organize your games from Wii, GameCube, and then do it from other. All right, so now there's two default themes. Here you would see the default theme, and then if you go over to the settings, head down to interface, go down to the bottom where you see theme. If you switch it over to flipper, you'll see the other default theme that has been created. I like this one, so I'm personally gonna save it as this. Special thanks to TXF and your own dad for the new themes. They went absolutely crazy, and I can't wait to see the other themes you guys make in the future. Now, they also added a way so you could disconnect the controllers, and the way you would do it is if you head over to the settings, go down to the controls, now when you go to the ports for the controllers, if you go to the profile and make sure it's set to none, it'll make sure that that specific port for the controller is disconnected. So for those having issues in some games with the cursor being on the screen or two controllers being used as one, this will definitely help your issue. And then also there's a small refactor and a bunch of miscellaneous bug fixes. And also a special thanks for Sir Mangler for this amazing update. I can't wait to use it on my own and I'm very excited to hear what you guys think. If you want the new update, you can find on the github link for sir mangler or if you're in my discord you can find it in there as well i hope this video was helpful if it was please hit that like and follow for more and I hope to catch you guys on the next one